Hey you guys, um, so the lighting is kind of crazy right now, but it's because it's super bright outside and yeah, it's like 4.30. Um, so I'm just going to show you what I do, like my lip routine. Has anyone ever done that? Because I don't think they have. But I go through like a routine of like different things that I do before I put on my lipstick and stuff. So I'll show you what I do. So first I use this. Lush um, lip scrub, and mine is in mint tulip. <laughs> tulip. <sighs> okay. So I like to get. See this? Is what it looks like. Lip scrubs are just a sugary scrub that um, removes like dead skin on your lips and smoothens it out and stuff. So, you just take a little on your finger, and you just rub it on your lips. It's kind of awkward doing this on camera. You can use your lips to, like, go like that. But, now that you have all the sugar on your lips, you lick it off. I know, right? I just want to make sure that's like no, no extra. Yeah, that's like my favorite thing about this is that you can lick it off. It's pretty, pretty good, sweet. So the next thing I do is making sure there's no sugar left on my lips. Okay, next thing I do is I take this Avon on everyone's lips daily lip refiner, and it's like a primer. So I take they they don't have this anymore. This is really old. It's a towel like packaging, and you just. I just put a little bit on my finger because a little bit goes a long way. And I don't know if you could see this. Kind of as if I'm like applying lip balm or something. And then you let it dry and it gets kind of like hard and it makes your lips very matte. I don't know if you can see. My lips look pretty matte now. Just wait like 10 seconds, 15 seconds, I don't know. So, next thing I do is I use my lip liner and this one is like running out and I need to get a new one. This one's Revlon's Color Stay Lip Liner in red. I really can't read it anyways, but that says red. And that's like my, as much as I have left. So I just kind of use it. That's what I have. Normally what I would do is fill in my whole lip, but since I don't have very much lip liner left, I just line the outside. So awkward on camera. Okay, and then I use my CoverGirl which I've already put in a video of mine. This is my CoverGirl um, lipstick in Hot Passion. Can't read that, but whatever. And I just put this on. Hope you can see this. Um, I'm just trying to get it to look right. Um. 
Okay. So after that long process, um, it's kind of sloppy looking, but it's kind of weird on camera, so I'm just not going to stay on camera like that. Then what I do is I get a tissue, and I do the method where you put your pinky in your mouth, and it looks kind of... That was someone else. <laughs> Um, and it looks kind of awkward and kind of dirty, but, yeah, it works. And, like, it gets off all of the lipstick, so I just use a tissue. And I do it, like, a couple times until there's, like, no lipstick showing up. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. What that does is it keeps lipstick off of your teeth because that would be really awkward if you had lipstick on your teeth which kind of sucks with red lipstick because it happens anyways but it just kind of helps. But yeah, that's what I do for my lips routine. So, yeah, it's kind of awkward but hopefully it was interesting and maybe helped you to find something to do like maybe if you wanted a lip scrub. This one I highly suggest suggest. It's really nice and it tastes delicious. So yeah, thank you for watching and subscribe if you haven't already because I'm trying to make more subscribers and it's not really working out. But yeah, please subscribe if you haven't. So thanks for watching.